All right, welcome back, everybody. We are still rolling. The last run was Keeper, and what a run it was. Now, a uh, character I kind of forgot about in... So, oh, let me back up a little bit more. Uh, we're going around the whole wheel, uh, you and me, and uh, everyone in between. We're trying to get around the whole wheel here with uh, every character. See if you can win, uh, have a win streak with, you know, doing something like that. So that's the current goal. Uh, so far, so, so good, to be completely honest. Um, we've made it to Apollyon, who's close to the end. Yeah, the end is in sight, very much in sight. Now, there's two characters. There's, I mean, so Bethany should not be a major game changer, but uh, things like the Forgotten and Jacob and Esau absolutely have something to uh, offer as far as challenge-wise. And I, the first round of videos has finally come out, uh, so I, I apologize for those who made a comment in one of the earlier videos, and it feels like I'm just getting to you now. Um, but you're right, uh, as people were calling me out, I don't want to say calling me out, but uh, I asked for opinions, and somebody's opinion was, uh, hey, there's nothing wrong with editing, but just, you know, you could probably edit a little better, and that's true. Uh, you know, the, the, oh, ow. the edited videos I've released, you know, the, the one that was counted on was like an 11-minute video, not a very long time. So this one's going to be edited, uh, and usually what my style is, I'll just stop talking, but I think this time I'm just going to treat it like a normal run so I can input more things you know because usually what happens I'm doing something and I won't say a single thing so it's like well I don't want to include that and have nothing to talk about but I will give it a shot so this one will be shorter just just anticipate that everyone this one will definitely be shorter than the regular run and yeah let's buckle up here we can talk about Apollyon while we fight <clears throat> this boss and two bombs for the boss that is potentially a problem namely looking mainly at you mr. ragman or or the haunt at this point um, but Larry jr. should be no trouble we also got that weird one where it doesn't actually spawn a full boss it's like Larry jr. and his cousin I don't really know who it is um, but let's get into a polyam so stats wise not signif statistically significant right off the jump however uh, starting with the void and I, when I was ranking characters, I feel like I didn't really think about Apollyon, uh, and that that I didn't I didn't do Apollyon a, ser a very good service because truthfully, Apollyon is one of the best characters because he starts with one of the best items in the game. I know I can't believe I forgot. So shout out to Apollyon for uh, not not taking me to Twitter and you know exposing me as a fraud. Big shout out there. We're gonna open this. And you know what? How about you guys just sit with me for the first floor? How about that? Uh, you're not going anywhere, okay? <laughs> so, <laughs> you get comfortable. Five cents gets the arcade. And, yeah, so I truly think... Well, that's cool. Uh, see if we can somehow void that. But, to start with the void... Is this Abyss or Void? Void. Void, one of the best to do it. We're going to be able to turn a lot of just garbage items, or items we just don't really want, into stats. I mean, it's going to be incredible. It's going to be awesome. And I'm looking forward to it. So... Can't, don't really have much choice to, but to take that one. So, uh, was there a battery in here? Okay, good. I was worried there was. I will buy the spirit heart. <sighs> I believe in myself. <laughs> All right. So, see you guys for the next floor. We're gonna get this thing rolling though. And again, um, you know, I'm no. If you got an opinion, by all means, share it. I'm no. I am no man to say I'm doing the best I possibly can just yet. You know, I'm, I'm still learning, okay? I'm still trying my best, but that doesn't mean that uh, it is the best. So uh, let me know, guys. Let me know. Keep keep the comments coming if you got things you want to see. Uh, I'd love to I'd love to hear it. So let's rock. Totally worth going in here just to check it all out. Gup's Collar. That's good, man, but I'd rather have stats. Oh, I, maybe that's... That might be honestly a pretty controversial poll, um, but we're early enough on the floor that I'm like, dude, I just I just need to start making void happen, and we got damage up. So, you know, I I really wouldn't do that on most runs. So if you see Guppy's collar, I'd take it. You know, Guppy items. I I swear, if we get two Guppy items, it was an absolute throw, and I should not have done that. But honestly, even now, I'm telling you, I shouldn't have done it. So that, what does that tell you? <laughs> but we're close enough to the item room. We can take a look. And it's dead eye, which is just amazing. Dead eye is such a good item. A good any time you see it, man. You hit, you hit an enemy, you, your damage goes up. It's simple as. And it, brother, I am a dead eye <laughs> myself. So 
It's also very forgiving. You know, you can miss a few times, it feels like, and it'll still give you the grace of double damage. Because it's it, it will double... Oh, I tried to... Okay, I was getting too cute there, I guess. No deal with the devil for me on this floor. And that's the risky run. We didn't pick up a spirit heart. And truthfully, the goal was to get... I mean, knowingly doing that, because I wanted an arcade, which didn't spawn on this floor. So that's certainly a bummer. We, put, we, we made a play for that, and it just didn't pan didn't pay but we got just enough charge okay well okay if it makes me feel any better we're absolutely gonna get hit in here gurglings is legitimately my, a nightmare matchup for me every time i see him although weirdly oh yeah so there you go there you go i don't feel bad at all about that um honestly for a luck up i'm just gonna say give me the stats and it's tears and luck so this is void man this is void doing void things i'm already happy so unfortunate dodging um, which means we no longer can count on deal with the devil, but we got tears up in range. So tears is now 3.73. We're looking good. We're happy to see a high tier rate already. That's that's a good thing for sure. There's certainly somebody could say go to the shop first in case there's more options, but what? I have never seen this item room in my life. What is this? You can. I have. I, I've never, I, I am honestly, I have no, I had no idea that was a thing. I, I cannot believe it actually, I'm actually, I'm fuming. <laughs> That's such garbage. So we're kind of limping to this shop here, I'm not gonna lie, and Black Candle is amazing. That is amazing find. Uh, curse Immunity, unfortunately we got Curse of Labyrinth on this floor. We'll buy this, oh two of diamonds is a good one to hold on to. So I'm hoping. I'm hoping. We've got Frail on deck first. And honestly, we're pretty much done with this floor, right? I mean, yeah, we saw a lot. It's just, I am, I'm just still not over the fact that there can be item rooms with no items. I've never, I would love to know the percent of like how often that shows up. Cause dude, that is, that's awful. <laughs> this is absolutely dreadful. And now something to consider, honestly, with once we get Apollyon rocking is you don't want to avoid everything. Cause eventually, What's going to be better than Tears and Shots be just on the cuff? Nothing, man. That's that is a gimme if I've ever seen it. And Bombino is a tough one. I have never liked Bombino. Always hated him. That's not going to change today. Oh, my lord. Oh. Oh, he hit the wall. This is my least favorite part is when stuff falls from the ceiling. I would love to know what you guys think about him. Um, I feel good about Blue Cap. I really do. Let's see what's in here, though. We did get Deal with the Devil, which is really, really good. And Gimpy is, is is good enough to take, certainly. And we're at that we're at that weird point where Sister Magster, also really good. Um, so yeah, we'll take Blue Cap. Happily take Blue Cap. And I don't know if I'm done with this floor or not. I'm, I'll, I'll look around. Okay, so now we can Hangman card. And this is quite awesome if we get... Yeah, so Counterfeit Penny, honestly is fun for right here right now it's definitely not better than pay to win though restock machines in item rooms is insanely better i mean that's just that's a guarantee and now that we know what this is we can take a fat range up range up, range up. <clears throat> that's right baby that is right all right well you know we did we did uh, we had a pretty decent haul we picked up four items on this floor all things considered i'm happy okay well the boss I mean, the boss before finding anything else is just, so what? We'll try it. With 75% chance to deal with the devil, I'm really liking those odds. Three in every four, man. This this could this could be exactly what we need. Uh, and, you know, having low damage, we've only, so I say low, we've only gotten Void to give us one damage up and to put us at 4.5. But as long as we're hitting an enemy, it's nine. And there goes our only black art. We've yet to collect, and... <laughs> <laughs> um i abyss is just is just not it's funny that it shows up though uh but void is certainly better and uh, anything's better than this damage and tears is certainly better than uh the soul mom's locket let's go do some freaking exploring here ow all right well we got through uh i will two of diamonds we'll do a little bit of reroll um because i'm not like i'm not out of this but I'm, f I'm fine voiding. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> uh, that's a very spicy pick. 
but I'm a spicy guy. It's possible. Okay, so 9 volt, I do feel good with. I mean, we'll see what I can do with it, but hopefully there's hopefully there's still a lot of time to see a bunch of item pedestals. We just don't know. Uh, it's it's gonna it's gonna come down to it though. A world card is just really good. I'll tell you what, let's go. We're gonna go in. We're gonna fight mom because we have the fool card. And I'm just trying to make sure because I don't have spirit hearts. I don't want. I don't. This is my best chance to to have 37% chance of deal with the devil. Okay. Like I don't. I don't. There's no way of knowing I'll be able to keep good HP. And it actually completely paid off because we did get the deal with the devil. Holy. Um. So mom's knife is cool. It's just not what I want. Is that? That's selfish of me to say. Here's what I should do, right? I should take Judas' shadow and take Mom's knife and just die with and have Mom's knife. Is that the correct play? Yeah, because now we've got 18 damage. Okay, that's probably the correct play. So now, now we're balling. We got Mom's knife. We're we're, we're doing all right. <laughs> Being a poop room like that other one was, I think I'll be fine. And Baltar. So we got 74 pennies, man. This is the. T oh Lord, really? Uh, um, D6, man, is, is a very good item, uh, but we're going to roll, because because we are who we are, I'm going to hold on to Void, and yeah, we're just going to see if we can get, I, honestly, at this point, what am I hoping for? Uh, oh, uh, not this, I know that, well, oh well, okay, there it was, oh, yeah, oh, we got it, okay, well, we'll, we'll happily scatole that into a massive damage up and our tears up so uh because any hp is good hp i know uh, okay i I'm, I'm gonna stick by that i'm absolutely gonna stick by that a spirit heart here is a spirit heart we want so and i gave up a black heart it is mr fred so uh it turns out you know, maybe the high range is gonna come in handy somewhere down the line but he's got a lot of friends in here what the heck buddies better chill out and I can look at this. I can just <clears throat> long range them, basically from infinity onward. Yeah, later bozo. Uh, yeah, I don't want the speed, man. But at the same time, what else would I rather have? Eh. Shot speed and speed. Okay, thank you, game. Is this depth two? Oh, it is one two. Okay, so yeah, we might do good damage here. Oh yeah, we do great damage here. Okay, we just get rid of the eyeball. There's no sense of playing around with it. Eighty percent deal the devil, and we didn't get it. <laughs> I mean. Damn, <laughs> that's kind of a surprise. I'm not gonna lie, but we do great damage, so we just need to survive. That's that's the only thing now, is I need to take these four four spirit hearts and take them to the finish line. That's all I need to do. Happy to see that. I, five HP is the most I've. Oh my, we actually did skip <laughs> with the secret room. <laughs> we did four rooms and they're at the boss. That's that's incredibly fa missed them. That's incredibly fast. And oh my lord, we do damage. Oh my lord, we do damage. <laughs> uh, there's the seed. I know I haven't shown it yet. That is the seed, man. And this is the run. I, who would have thought 20 damage mom's knife is uh, really good? <laughs> Not me. I know that. Now with the chests, we've got a whole lot of... Oh, why did I take that? Why did I take that? Because I can turn all this into... I honestly want this. It's a range down, which I'm, I want. And then we're gonna turn this into speed and luck. And maybe some tears there, I think I saw. We found the deal, we found the final room, potentially. And this is, I mean, this is a spanktastic run. It was a little, little treacherous there for a sec, but the damage speaks for itself in just, in just the loudest of ways here. My goodness. Yeah, oh my lord. As soon as you get it to just cook, there's no stopping him. So we got the, we got the pea knife at the very end there. That's a wrap. I hope you guys enjoyed. I, it was a fun one. Can't complain. And I'll see you all for uh, the next one. Who I can't remember who it is off the top of my head. Forgotten. We're forgotten.